Hey everyone, Tim Schofield here from KiwiKing77.com with an exciting video. You can now root your Galaxy S6 without tripping the Knox counter so it'll keep your warranty with Samsung. Now you don't even need a computer to root either. So this is really great. It's called Ping Pong Root. And this is also confirmed working for all variants, including Verizon and AT&T. It's crazy. So let's get going. I recommend going to the Play Store, downloading an app called uh, RAR for Android. So you'll see right here, I have it. Just because we're going to need to unzip a quick file. Then what you can do is on your phone, or I'll post a link in the description of the video, actually. I'm just going to run to my website real quick. Um, I'm going to post a download link in the description, so if you want to just click on that, um, you'll see I have an article, How to Root Galaxy S6, um, and then there's a download link. It's going to take you to the XDA website where the ping pong route is actually at. Okay, so go ahead and scroll down, and then I'll give you all your supported devices. Make sure you check and make sure your build is on there, all that good stuff. Uh, you just let, you'll see, yes, AT&T supported, Verizon's there as well. Um, just keep going down until you get to the bottom and there should be a party, you'll see party beta three. It's in beta three as of this video. Obviously, if it got updated, just check all the compatibility, everything like that. So it's dot seven zip, so it's a zip file. You'll see it's downloading. We're gonna wanna go ahead and click on it and then open it with that RAR app. So let's go ahead and go into it. And then you'll see inside is that ping pong beta three APK. Go ahead and check it and then press this little arrow up right there. And then you just have a destination path. If you want to throw it in the downloads folder, you can. I'm just going to hit OK. And there we go. All right, so it says it was extracted. Now what we're going to need to do is go to a file explorer. So you'll see I have my, you all have my files app right there. Um, let's just go to device storage and then go to that downloads folder, which we extracted that party beta right here. And here's ping pong root beta three. Select it. You might have to check unknown sources and security. If you need to, just make sure you check that box, go back, press the APK, and then just hit install. It's going to go ahead and install the ping pong root app installed and let's go ahead and open it and you'll see get root. That's all that's that there is to it. So just hit get root, wait. And then I think you have to reboot your device. I'm going to let this run. I'll be right back. All right, didn't take too long, maybe 30 seconds. It's recommended you reboot your device now and just press OK. Press and hold the power button. There's a restart button right there. Let's reboot it and I'll be right back. All right, and we're booted up. Now in your app drawer, just go ahead and go to the end and you'll see King user right there. Just go ahead and select it, open it on up. And now we're ready to go. So basically it's showing that we're rooted right here because we can allow or deny uh, permissions deny this one if you're on T-Mobile and this comes up make sure you hit deny do not allow root privilege to that specific one now you'll see right here I mean that showed that proved that we're rooted right there that was asking us for root uh, access root authorization you'll see root checker basic you can allow it those are all of your uh, root apps and there we go we're good to go you're not rooted no knocks uh, tri counter tripped and that's it so thank you for watching hopefully this video helped you out if it did please subscribe you can follow me on Twitter Facebook, Google Plus, all links in the description of the video below. And thanks for watching, guys.